amazing. This life is not an easy one. I've got this. You don't want any part of this. I am Spider-Man. Spider-Man's name is Peter Parker. Yes, What is going on, everyone, and welcome back to News for Astonish, where we discuss comics, movies, games, and more. My name is Ronnie, and what you just saw were trailers for all eight previous Spider-Man films, and a trailer telling you all to catch up with Peter Parker's adventures from Homecoming and Far From Home. Sony then quickly unlisted them. Luckily, I was quick enough to snag these trailers for you all to see, and we're going to discuss this. It's Spider-Man Fan Week, and as many of you Spider-Man fans know, Spider-Man debuted in Amazing Fantasy number 15 back in August 1962. There isn't an exact date, so normally fans have decided to dub August 1st National Spider-Man Day. Before I get into it, I want you all to like, subscribe, and click on that bell notification so you all don't miss anything related to comic books, movies, Spider-Man goodness, and more. We just reached 4,000 subscribers at the time of me making this video, and I'm not showing any signs of stopping, so let's hit that 10K. I post videos on the daily and I do live streams twice a week on Tuesdays and Sundays between 8.30 p.m. to 10.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Follow me over on Twitch and join my Discord. The links to those are in the description box below. So, Sony just dropped some trailers of older Spider-Man movies as we're supposedly going to be getting the Spider-Man No Way Home trailer real soon. One would ask, why hasn't Sony dropped the trailers to Spider-Man No Way Home? Why are we getting trailers of the older Spider-Man films? What even is this movie? Is Sony trolling us? What's the meaning of life? Honestly, I think something big is happening, and as a lot of us content creators have spent so much time researching, looking for clues, and speculating what's about to transpire in Spider-Man No Way Home, Sony just keeps disappointing us with useless teasing, trolling, and now this? It's funny because these trailers say so much, but so little at the same time. Why would Sony drop these trailers now? Could this be official confirmation that both Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield are set to appear in Spider-Man No Way Home? Look. We're pretty upset that we haven't even gotten the trailers for Spider-Man No Way Home, and Sony knows this too. I think that's why they disabled the comment section in the first place. The first trailer you saw was Spider-Man Fan Week, and as crazy as it is right now with everyone when we're going to see the trailer, Sony is promoting Spider-Man Fan Week. Yesterday, we did get that Tom Holland trailer to his first two Spider-Man movies. This is everywhere right now from Sony. They released the video and titled it Catch Up With Homecoming and Far From Home Before You See No Way Home. Now that we see Sony pushing these trailers, including Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield, it makes it difficult not to read into this if you think about it. Again, so much and so little is being said here, and my gut's telling me that the likelihood of seeing Toby and Andrew Garfield returning to the role is really high. Now, with these trailers going around online, it's safe to say that Sony is trying to tell us something, and that's pretty much them saying, hey, go watch these movies in the meantime to catch up so you know the backstories of these Peter Parkers and, of course, Miles Morales. Yes, that's right, Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse is included. Of course, it's easy to say that it's probably a coincidence Sony's just doing this to promote Spider-Man Week, but then again, August 1st is right around the corner. You and I know that Sony knows exactly what they're doing here, and it's probably most likely because the trailer is about to drop on August 1st. Then again, I could be wrong. Sony knows that we have an idea of who's going to be in Spider-Man No Way Home. Honestly, August 1st is the perfect day to release the trailer. It will be Spider-Man Day after all. It'll only be poetic if the trailer drops that day. But let me know what you guys think. Am I reading too much into this? When do you think the trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home will drop? Comment down below with your theories. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click on that bell notification so you all don't miss anything. And I will see you all in the next comic panel.